No one wants to be glued to a computer screen. So if you want to see how we can use Paddy Power Trader to keep an eye on our trades, click on the Next Page button. So far, when we've opened or closed a bet, we have placed a trade, which is just a fancy way of saying our bet is bought or sold straight away. Click on the Show Me button for a quick reminder. Placing a trade is great, but there are limitations. A new order opens a position if and only if the price reaches a level you choose. This slide explains a little more. Let's have a look at an example. When you're ready, the Show Me button will show you how to put a new order into PaddyPowerTrader.com. Notice that we are clicking on the Order button rather than on the Trade button. We can check or change our new orders from our order book. Now that our new buy order is set, if the price hits the level we chose, our bet will be opened. Of course, we can have several new orders open at once. Use the Show Me button to see how we would open a new sell order on the FTSE. This order, along with our previous one, will be kept in our order book. When using new orders, we need to keep a watchful eye on our trading resources. Cancelled orders are kept in the cancelled section of our order book. Stop loss orders are a particular type of new order. We discussed them in tutorial 2, 
But here's a reminder. Once we have bought a bet, we use stop loss orders to limit our losses. And in the same way, we can use limit profit orders to take our profits. Limit profit orders are created from our order book. Once you are used to using all these order types, you might want to combine them in what's called an if-done or conditional order. We start with a new order. However, we then click on the If Done button and enter a stop loss or a limit order or both. There's one more type of order, and that's called a one cancels other order. However, the main thing to remember is that while these orders are there to make our lives easier, they are no substitute for monitoring the markets ourselves. Paddy Power Trader will send you an email if you place a trade or create or alter an order. So, please keep us informed of any changes to your email address. We've covered a lot of different orders in this tutorial, so here's a summary. That's it for Tutorial 4. However, if you want to keep on learning, Come on over to the Trading Academy, where you'll find some great articles about spread betting and the financial markets.